The state is not an LMSR institution. Yikes. Okay. That the advantage of profitability from the tenant's perspective is that it creates a coherent management objective. Profitable corporations tend to provide better customer service because coherently managed organizations tend to be more efficient. This is why you never see the National Hamburger Society on the list of restaurants at the next exit. Well, there you go, Logos. There you go. I mean, if you pay a landlord rent, I mean, it's to your benefit if he uh, maximizes profit from you. Yeah. I mean, it, it, it depends on what corporations are profit to, cutting to be profitable. A really good example of this would be World of Warcraft. Um, when Blizzard's profits were going downhill many years back, they laid off mostly their customer service staff. And so now it takes forever to get in-game queues dealt with. It takes forever to get, you know, uh, uh, game masters to solve your problems or whatever. Um, people have, like, made complaints and got automated responses that don't really address their complaints because they're trying to use automation to as efficiently deal with loads of complaints as possible. Um, so if you cut the customer service you know, apparatus to, to maximize short run profits, then obviously profits don't mean customer service. Um, now the only argument they can make there is, well, if customer service is bad as it, pe then, then people will quit. It's like, yeah, eventually, but that's the problem. They quit because the customer service was bad because it was good for profits until it wasn't. Now take that principle and map it to a state that controls your property and your person. That's yeah. terrifying. <laughs> yeah. Well, we already know. It's called East India Company. I mean, again. I mean, that's just basically, hey, get Kafka-esque catch-22s and, you know, the beatings will continue until morale improves and whatnot, right? Imagine imagine that the, 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 the corporation that controls your life has a customer service issue because they lay off most of their customer service people. They're <laughs> supposed to speak on behalf of the tenants. And so you have a bunch of dystop dystopian commissars treating people like garbage. And they laid off the people that were supposed to mediate those disputes for mm -hmm. profits. Oops. Oops. 